Hello friend, this is Gaurav Ahuja from Rajan Animators blog. Today we are going to create some shadow effects for website, especially for banners or carousel images. So first shadow we are going to create is the shadow number four. Let me zoom in. Yes, this one. This is the simple shadow which uh, we use for giving some depth to the carousels or images. So for this, I am having a setup yes you can see it here so this is the background image which is white and uh, having uh, one more image on that which is a uh, painting which I have uh, uh, collected from Devint Art thanks to the artist which who created this so firstly uh, we going to give a stroke on the images on the image which I'm gonna use so this is the image and I'm giving the stroke of uh, uh, let me change the color so that I can see uh, the size of um, I think 10 is sufficient for us or uh, 8 yeah it is color white okay and uh, one more thing which I'm going to give that is shadow shadow uh, with the um, with color uh, dark gray and size but high yes uh, yes so I'm just uh, going to decrease the distance so that shadow will be covered from all the sides okay yes here we can see so uh, with this setup uh, we can see the image is looking much better than before yes here it is uh, just to compare I'm just switching off the both of the uh, effects and we can see the difference yeah it is looking much better than before so uh, the next thing which are going to create the shadow main shadow which will give a depth to the image so for this firstly we'll create a selection a rounded selection which is uh, approx this which I'm going to create you can see yes and fill it with a black color okay and uh, just apply a filter on this which is doesn't blur yes here it is then uh, it is giving a, a but depth to the image but not that which we want so just make it a bit large and now I'm just gonna add one more uh, filter on that which is blur and motion blur yes here it is so I got this thing or I'm just gonna spread it over the image yes here it is now I got uh, the perfect output which I want yes here it is or uh, now I can play with the opacity of the shadow layer so that uh, or even I can play with the color of it which is uh, I can change with the help of color overlay if I want it to be something like this green or dark green or according to my theme so this is the first shadow kind which we got and just we can adjust and play with it yes here it is and we it is simple we got it thank you